Hey guys, what's going on? It's your count 23 back with another video. Today we return to the Red Sox M20. We are currently up three to nothing on Cleveland in the ALCS. Today we are gonna try to sweep them. So right now we're hopping into the top of the six. The Red Sox are hitless uh, against Shane Bieber. We're gonna try to turn that around right here. All right, here we go. Devers leading things off in the top of the six. Like I said, Bieber is dealing this game. We do not have a hit yet as a team. We got to change that. And there we go. A nice hard hit ball into left field. It is going to be playable though. One down. If we learned anything from game three of this series, it's that the sixth inning and the seventh inning is when you need to attack. You need to score here. If we don't here, we don't want to have to do it in the 12th again. Andrew Benintendi catches that curveball. Never mind. It's going to be playable. Christian Yelich struck out. Rip. All right, man. Bieber is dealing. We're going to have to match that pitcher uh, that pitcher level. All right. We got Brian Johnson on the hill. He's doing a pretty good job so far. Uh, he's not throwing a no-hitter, but he is throwing a shutout, and that's what matters right now. So let's keep it going. And, oh, boy, leadoff double from Roberto Perez. He does have eight speed, but he's going to get two bags here. Uh, hit that one right into the gap. Drop the slider on him. Let's go. That's a big out right there. Top of the order. Cesar Hernandez goes down swinging. Drop the curve. Let's go. Oh, Brian. Brian, no. Oh, I thought that was going to be an easy play for Brian. But he does whiff on it, and now the corners are covered. One down. Jose Ramirez down the line. It's going to hug the line. Staying fair just barely. And the, co the corners are covered again. Swing at this. Let's go. All right. Brown Mill Reyes strikes out. That's big. Oh, we needed that. We needed that out. All right. Santana gets that curveball up the middle. The Cleveland Millions are making no mistakes. They are they're hitting the ball well. If I miss it, they're hitting it. Come on. Let's go. All right. Devers makes the play. That'll end a rough six inning for the Red Sox. We're down 2 nothing. JD with a fastball. Oh, that's center cut. We need to kill that. Oh, man. Freddie Freeman, there we go. Slider, and it's just, oh, it just doesn't have enough on it. Good, good. It just right to the center fielder. Let's go, Bogarts. That ball is crushed. That definitely has to be a hit. There we go. That's our first of the game. It's going to be a double, though, so a, a dinger ties it. Oh, let's go, Dustin. That's an absolutely perfect swing. That ball is a little bit below the zone, but he just got his bat right to it, and that is going to get us a run. I'll take it. Okay, so the Indians just brought in Oliver Perez, and I didn't even really take a notice of this, but if you look at the lineup right now, we have Vasquez coming up, a righty, then four lefties in a row from the 9-1, 2-3 hole. So this is going to be tough because Perez is a really good pitcher against lefties, so let's really try to maximize this at bat with Vasquez. Christian up the middle, tie game. Way to swing the bats. Let's go. A couple perfect perfects in a row, and we find ourselves tied. JBJ pops it up. That'll end the inning, but we do tie this game, and I'll definitely take that. We just needed that momentum right back. All right, I think Brian Johnson, after the last inning, has proven that I think it's time for him to come out of this game. He had a solid start, but we're going to go to Austin Bryce. There we go. Good start, Bryce. Three pitches. Naquin pops it up. JBJ's under it. One down. Ooh, we hung that curveball. It's punished, and we're just going to get there. JBJ in center field makes the play. There we go. Back to the pitcher. The 7-8-9 go down 1-2-3. It's time for the eighth inning. So both teams are going to have the top of their order up in the eighth inning. Now ours is, of course, all lefties, and we're going to have to face Perez. So this will be a little bit of a challenge. Rafael Devers left field. I think I missed that one. I did, and it's going to stay in play. Andrew Benintendi, I think I moved yeah, I moved my PCI away from the ball right there. Big rip. Yelich rolls that one over, and we go down 1-2-3, unfortunately. Didn't do too much there. We're making ourselves do it in the ninth. Good start by Austin Bryce, striking out Cesar. I don't know why the, uh, the blue called that, but we'll take it. Austin Mercado just smacked that pitch. First pitch he saw. That's going to be off the wall. Can we stop it? No. That's all I wanted. All I wanted was him to be in front of that baseball, and then we avoid a triple, but he just couldn't do it. I couldn't get that animation. 
He's at he's at third base. Payoff pitch. He takes it. All right, man. Good eye. You know what? I'm fine with that. It sets up the double play. I needed him to. I need a strikeout. That's pretty much all I can get right now. That was hung like no tomorrow. Reyes is just gonna punish it, and the Indians take the lead. That was a mistake pitch. Oh my goodness, Santana killed that. He fouled off quite a few pitches off the plate though, so I'm okay with that result because honestly, he probably should have struck out. There we go. That should get me out of the inning. Come on, come on. Let's go. All right, we're down one. We're back against the wall, but hopefully we can make this comeback. JD Martinez, I was 12 years in front of that pitch. Out number one. Let's go. Oh, that's ridiculous. Oh, you hate to see it. That's the last thing we, this whole team needs. An early squared up 104 bullet. It's down to Xander. Xander, it's right to him. Right to the third baseman. Played it perfectly. And the game is over. We do not complete the sweep. Rip. That is honestly a brutal result. Four of those ice cold chips, whatever you want to call them. I feel like that's an insane amount for losing a sweep game on the road. That does hurt right there. We were just unable to score when we really needed to. The Indians got that run in the eighth. We just couldn't, we couldn't back it up in the ninth. Unfortunate, the team didn't have it today. Um, the good news is, I mean, we're still up three to one, but a sweep would have been nice, I think, for the team momentum. It, it's going to get killed right now. Yeah, there it goes. Um, I think our next game is, yeah, it's still in Cleveland, so we're gonna try to have to win on the road again, but let's see what the game makes us do, if we're still in the sixth inning or where we're at in this moment. Top of the sixth, one to nothing. All right, that will be our next moment. But for now, guys, I'm gonna call it. Hopefully, you guys are enjoying the series, and I will see you guys all in the next video to see if we can advance to the Fall Classic. Peace out.